a UFC featherweight division fight. All right, so here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. Oh, nice land with the knee. You see the taller fighter having no issue getting the limb to the target there. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. <laughs> you are battering that nose. 90 seconds remain in the round. It's such a fast leg Ooh, that uppercut landed for him. Oh, nice jab. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Big kick lands. Single collar tie now. Notice the drive. Look at how they drive the knee right into the midsection. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Oh, man, look at that. Picture perfect. Got to the leg, got to his position, got another beautiful takedown. Round two straight ahead. Well, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1 level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, DC, second round is getting underway. Round one, not the round of the year necessarily, but some good in there. And it's not always going to be. You have to be very talented fighters. Sometimes it's very even. That's what we saw in round number one. Able to check the high kick. Oh, he lands a huge kick here. Oh! Oh, straight right. Under two minutes to go. Dig and kick. Circling to his right. Hook lands. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? And that's the end of round number two. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round. And he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there and he's not on his toes and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment.
right, pretty good back and forth action in the previous two rounds. Your expectations here as this next round gets on. I expect the action to really pick up now. These guys have to lay it on the line as we start to approach the end of the fight. Oh, lands another beautiful strike to the body, really starting to connect at will when it comes to work in the body, and especially effective doing it later in this fight. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. He got him. How about that chin? Oh, he lands a huge knee to the body. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing it. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Nice kick to the body. Look at the control of the posture as they land that knee. Oh! Huge block there. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's your replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage him. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Right punches there. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. John. He's got to press him. He's got to go take Whoa. that finish down now. That leg kick. Slips the punch. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. 45 seconds remain in the round. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Blocks the shot. Nice punch lands over the top. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Big roundhouse now, just misses. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. Fifth and final round. 
great punch. Nice jab, follows it up with a nice right hand. Big leg kick lands. Oh, massive knee to the body. That can't feel good. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Ooh, blocks the shot. Big head kick lands. Under two minutes now to go in the fight. Can't take many of those, you better check. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. The guard lands the right hand. One minute to go in the fight. Oh, is that a big knee to the body? We'll see if he can follow up. Nice kick. Ooh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Lee. Right on the button. Oh! Huge kick to the body! Oh! And they separate. The final horn sounds! All right, so a lot to like over the distance of that fight tonight. Clearly, we think we saw one guy win the fight and largely got it done with the striking. Yeah, he got it done with the striking. And that's exactly what he's known for. He's known as a guy that's so comfortable whenever he's in the stand-up. And that showed tonight as he truly outworked his opponent.